Hey everybody, it's Kareem from the blog Big Bella Donna Fashion. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm back with another crochet review. I'll be reviewing this hair, which is the Free Tris Island Twist. So if you're interested in hearing my quick thoughts about this hair, go ahead and stay tuned. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Free Tris Island Twist. I'm holding the back of it, but this is how it looks. I like to let you see what it looks like um, according to the picture, but basically this is what's left over. I bought two packs of this hair and I bought it in 1B. Uh, this is the Pre-Loop Island Twist. And this hair reminded me in the pack of the hair I just recently reviewed, um, the Caribbean Bohemian Straw Set. So that's why I got it because I wanted to kind of give the look another try since I wasn't too crazy about the uh, Bohemian Straw Set from the Caribbean. So I did give the look another try. So I rate on texture, wearability, and versatility when I rate my hair on my little five latch hook rating system. So here is the hair right out the pack. This is the Island Twist. It does come pre-looped with a uh, rubber band kind of slidey thing at the end slidey thing. That's the technical term So a little rubber band in to help you adjust it. I think that's a little bit more. Yeah adjustable um, Rubber band here to help you adjust the loop size um, I love the curl pattern right out the back. I mean right out the pack I really do like it as it comes, but you know me. I cannot keep anything how it comes Well rarely rarely how it comes this hair for texture. It gets actually great marks. It's it's you know firm, but not um, too coarse to the point where it's brittle feeling. And this particular hair does have an okay feel to it. It's um, you know got a nice sturdy firm feel because of the pattern. It holds in that cur cur um, blah, blah, the curl pattern. <laughs> so it has a nice firm feel to it. I've been wearing this for almost a week now and when I put it in, I did put it in just as is. I didn't cut it or anything like that, especially because it's already pre-looped. And I put in two, uh, not almost two packs, like um, a pack and uh, two thirds because like it's three bundles in each. So like a pack and two thirds and it felt fine. It wasn't too heavy. Um, it absolutely feels just fine. And I really did like the way it looked long, but I just cannot wear long hair. I don't know what it is. I like it but not on me. It's fine, you know, as far as how it feels. It's not too heavy, it's lightweight. It doesn't feel too different brushed out versus how I put it in right out the pack. So at the end, this was the end result of me just brushing it fiercely out with a big powder brush. And then after I looked at it for a while, I was like, you know what, this looks just like Marley hair, like any of your Marley hair you would see in the package and stuff. And I love Marley hair, but I didn't realize I was going with it. I was going to that direction when I was brushing it out. I just wanted it full, I just wanted it full. And I am not like, a real fan of super super defined curls so that's why I brushed it out as well so that actually speaks to the versatility you can wear it right out the pack which is most likely what you know if you're like me you're going to do you buy it because you like the curl pattern and you want to wear it exactly how it looks but if you want to use it obviously for braiding hair and you you're braiding it in you know you'll have maybe a little bit of it out or what have you sometimes people use this type of hair for faux locks and all type of creative things people do but I am an OTP you know what OTP yeah you know me out the pack that's how I want to wear it and the only way I might manipulate it is doing what I did to this cutting it and floop 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 Flooping it out, making it uh, a little bigger, a little more volume, and a little less defined, but you can still see the curl pattern. In that regard, you could wear it the way it comes out of the pack for a few weeks, and then if you don't want to take it out and you want to change up the look, get the, change up the look, get that brush and brush it out, and then it looks like a whole new style. So the free trust, I had it upside down. The free trust island twist gets a five latch hooks up. I think it does exactly what it says it's going to do. I really don't have any complaints about the hair. Every time I look at it, you know, I've worn it up, you know, it's workout friendly. I've worn it up to work out or just pull back. You know, I, I'm like, yeah, I'm good to go. So if you have enjoyed this edition of Big Belladonna's Crochet Reviews, let me know below. Remember to share, like, 
and subscribe and also comment if you have any questions about this hair or if there's any hair that you've been wondering if I've tried or want me to try, give me a shout out below, comment below, let me know. And remember to look back at the things you've missed and stay tuned for the things that are coming up. Thanks so much. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.